All right, what's up guys? It's your boy Waxy TV here guys. I just want to start off the video by saying this is a great day for the Waxy TV community and the YouTube channel as a whole as I'm bringing you today my first ever locker showcase video. Anyways, I'm going to go right into the script guys and then I'll get into the showcase of the emotes, the skins, the gliders and the pickaxes and everything cool that you guys want to see. If you guys want to be entered in a chance to win a giveaway, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on bell notifications. And when the gifting season comes back in on the season of gifting, uh, you can be nominated to be entered in the gift giveaway. So uh, all you have to do is turn on bell notifications, subscribe, like, and comment. And comment down below what your favorite skin is and why you want to get it and i'll do my best to see if i can gift y'all a skin anyways guys what's going on thanks for supporting our channel waxy tv is happy to say that the waxy army is the biggest and strongest fan base on youtube hashtag waxy's army wants you so if you like the channel don't forget to like subscribe and become part of our fan club and if you're a proud member of Waxy's Army, feel free to tip. All tips will be given a shout out on stream or on the next video I upload. Tipping is not mandatory, it's if you want to help support the channel. And yeah, so let's get right into this guys. Waxy TV's first ever locker showcase. Here we go. So I have the Nog Ops here. Uh, I don't know if I want to start with skins or start with pickaxes. Yeah, I'll just start with skins. So from the bottom, we have the whiplash skin. And at the end, I'll tally up what I think the skins are worth. And I'll let you guys know. So we got whiplash here. We got the crimson scout. Here, I'm going to go ahead and take off back blings so that you guys can actually see the detail of the skins. We got the blue team leader, which is like a PS exclusive skin. We got Zoe from the season three battle pass or season, yeah, season three battle pass skin. We have the wingman, which was a starter pack skin. We have the armadillo, the commando, Nog Ops, which is like my new favorite skin right now because of the Christmas season. We got Scorpion to match the armadillo skin. We got the Star Speckled Ranger from the Stars and Stripes set, part of the 4th of July skin. We got the Season 3 or 4, I want to say, the Visitor, I believe. Uh, we got the Blue Striker, which was like another PS exclusive skin. We got the DJ Yonder outfit. We also have Waypoint, a new skin to come into Fortnite, make your move. We got Snorkel Ops, which is like another one of my favorite OG tryhard skins. We also have Jump Shot, one of the basketball baller skins. We got the Bright Bomber, the Arctic Assassin, and Absolute Zero, two of my favorite snowy skins. I got the Ventura, and I have a couple of Twitch Prime skins, the Trailblazer. Uh, another battle pass skin the sledgehammer we got the NFL skins as always I love your boy Tom Brady big shout out to Tom Brady hashtag football MVP we got the squad leader we got the sub commando like if you guys played season three like one of the very first twitch prime packs that came out came with this and another skin we got the summit striker another bundle skin we got the Sun Strider, which was season four, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong. We got Technique from season three, the Ace, another starter pack bundle that came with V-Bucks, a back bling, and a skin. I got the Skull Trooper, but unfortunately it's not OG Skull Trooper, it's second gen Skull Trooper, so I don't have the purple Skull Trooper glow for it. We got Sergeant Winter. We got Rust Lord from like season three. I've got Rook, uh, Rogue Agent, which was like a starter pack skin, I believe. I got Redline, I have the Nightshade, I have Moonwalker, Fable, full outfit, I have Flap Jackie, I have the Giddy Up, I have the Growler, 
the Havak, the Havak, the Highlander Warrior, the Huntress, the Mission Specialist, the Elite Agent. I believe that's a Battle Pass skin too. I have the Dust skin fully unlocked. I have Caster outfit, like a homeless magician looking dude. I have the Battle Hawk. I have Zenith, Zenith. I have Wukong, I have Wild Card with all the stages. I got the War Paint, which is a skin you get for being a Founders member, like owning Save the World and playing Battle Royale. I got Max Ragnarok finally, all the tiers of Ragnarok unlocked. And we got the Enforcer, which was another Battle Pass skin collectible that you got for completing all the weekly challenges. I got Fate. I have this Frostbite skin I bought from one of the recent packs that was like a $34 skin. This is the Havoc skin that came with like Twitch Prime, I believe. Lynx, the Catwoman skin that I know all y'all really like. I have the Mushu, one of the samurai skins I really love playing as Meg. Uh, Omega, I never maxed out my Omega, which I really regret because I didn't play much in season three. I also never got John Wick, which is really sad because I really like that. I got Power Cord, I got Valor. I have the other, one of my other favorite samurai skins, Shogun. I have the Rose Team Leader, which was also a skin for owning save the world i have rex raven raven's girlfriend ravage and i have the raptor then i have clement which is fully maxed out with all the unlocks i have carbite which i never made it to fully unlocking him which is really sad I had to reach level 65 in season 4 and I didn't do it. I wish I did though, because it's a really cool looking skin. I got Cuddle Team Leader, Dark Voyager, I have Dyer, which I'm working on the full set unlock right now. I have to complete 60 weekly challenges and I need like 200 something thousand XP to unlock that. And I have the Max Unlock Drifter skin. It's pretty cool. It's still a nice skin to run around and play as. I do like like that variant of them a lot. Alright guys, so there you have it. There's the skin collections. And yeah, those are all the styles of skins I have. I have no reactive skins yet. But yeah, those are my skins. So now we'll move on to the back blings. So I've got the Havoc back bling that comes with the Twitch, one of the first Twitch Prime skins. That's uh, Blade Wings is for the Shogun. That came with the Cuddle Team Leader. That came with the Wild Card. The Dark Matter skin is a back bling for the Dark Voyager. The Dark Wings are the Ravage back bling. Wukong, so if you purchased Wukong back in the day, it didn't come with a back bling. In season four, they updated it and gave it a free back bling. If you purchased the Wukong, you got the Royal Flags back bling. There's the Raptor Satchel back bling, and that's uh, Pursuit. I believe that's for something, the Trailblazer or Summit skin. Uh, Ominous Orb, that's for my Fate skin or the Omen skin, yeah, I think it's the Fate back bling. That was like the Visitor's back bling, really cringy. The Iron Cage is the Raven's back bling. This is the Ragnarok back bling, it's a nice cape. Frozen Shard, that's for my $30 Frostbite skin. That's for my original Samurai backpack, that's obviously the Rex backpack, Power Cords back bling, and that's the Rose Team Leader backpack. Both the Founders back blings and skins came with their own back bling, the Enforcers back bling, the Moonwalkers back bling, the Blue Team Leader or the Blue Strike Leaders back bling, the Wingmen black bling, eh, back bling. I got the Skull Trooper back bling, but it's not OG because I didn't have the OG one, but I have both variants. 
Uh, Fable's Cape, Dusk's Wings. Um, this is like Crafted Carrier. And this is the Catalyst Back Bling. I have the ca the Chameleon Pet. The Highlander's Back Bling. I got a bunch of pets. Goodie Bag for Zoe. Nibbles. Nubbles Back Bling for the weird looking skins I have. Night Cloak. The perfect present back bling that goes really well with the Nog Ops or Christmas skins like the Yodel Ranger and Nog Ops. Pool Party back bling. I got the Rear Guard back bling. It's like for the Norris collection. The Rust Lord back bling. So the Rust Lord originally never had a back bling and this was added into the game a while ago, like season three. Scales. I got Wolf's, another back bling. DJ Yonders, Waveform, uh, Venturous Cape, uh, Unbuckle, which is like Sledgehammer's back bling, True North, which is the Trailblazer back bling, that's for the Summit Scout, that's the backpack that came with the, what's it called, the Ace skin, that's the back bling that came with my Caster skin, Precision came with the Havoc, in the first Twitch Prime skin, that's for the waypoint. And standard issue is just a skin I believe came with the Scout leader from season three, I believe. Advanced Forces, that's a trail tow. Another pet, more pets, and this was a birthday cake backlink. This is really cool and probably really rare because a lot of people didn't compete or do the challenges for. Fortnite's birthday update where it gave you like a bunch of challenges and you could unlock um, a back bling and a skin I believe. Anyways guys there you have it. There's the back blings, the favorites, the styles and my two reactive backpacks I have. Alright so now we're going to move on to the pickaxes. So starting from the top, we have the Space Explorer, the EVA, we have the Wukong uh, pickaxe, the Omega pickaxe, the Fate pickaxe, the Permafrost Ragnarok pickaxe. The pickaxe I really like is the Pick Squeak, it goes with the, the Rex skin, the Clematity pickaxe this pickaxe came with the $38 skin I bought frostbite that's the original pickaxe for my first samurai skin the balloon axe pickaxe from the battle pass um, this one's pretty cool because it's for the power cord and it makes like a guitar noise it's really cringy but it's pretty cool trusty number two the skull trooper pickaxe and we have the Scratch mark. I think that's the Lynx pickaxe set, part of the set for the Lynx. The Drifter set. The Red Knight pickaxe, which hopefully one day I'll have the Red Knight for. The Wukong axe. Uh, four Breaker axe for like the Norse set, the Vikings. The Valiant Gale Force pickaxe. Gliding Glow. Instigator, we have the Raven and Ravage pickaxe, the pickaxe that came with my second favorite Shogun Samurai, it's part of the Shogun set. We have this pickaxe, the Tendril that goes with the Flytrap set. I never got the Flytrap skin or the glider, I wish I did. This was a Twitch Prime pickaxe. This is for my cuddle team leader. This is DJ Yonder's smash up pickaxe. The Sawtooth, which was a Storm Scavenger set pickaxe. I believe it was a Battle Pass or came with a Twitch Prime. That's the Carbites pickaxe. The Lug Axe is part of the RPM set. The Sweet Tooth is Zoe's pickaxe. That's my Tom Brady pickaxe. That's for the weird skins I have. The Lucky Pickaxe right here. And this is just a tree splitter. It's just like a weird looking axe. This is the Abdominal Axe. Part of the Battle Pass for Season 7 for the Myth. Mountain Myth sets. And your default pickaxe. Um, so yeah. 
Okay guys, so now we're gonna get into the gliders, the ones I like, the ones I don't like, and I'll leave the contrails out of it. I might do an emote showcase later, but like I said, these are my favorite emotes. So we have the dab, the rambunctious, the swipe it, the break it down, the taddy, and boogie down, which is like a really rare two-step authentication emote. Looks pretty cool. All right, so now we're gonna get into the gliders, guys. So we got the Conquest Viking glider, the split stream that came with uh, Twitch Prime, the Dust glider, the Valor glider, the Blue Team Leader glider, the Raven glider, the Shogun glider. Carbon Glider and the ta Santa's Tactical Slay, Tactical Slay, Zoe's Glider, this is the Power Core Glider, Safe Cracker came with my wild card skin, it's pretty cool, it lets out money when it flies, the Rainbow Glider I bought for the Bright Bomber, the Prismatic Glider, it's so colorful. Um, this is like an interchangeable set, comes with like animal jacket set type deal, dog rabbit. Uh, this is a cold front glider, came with my $38 skin. The Flossil Flyer I bought for a matching glider for the Rex. This is for the Fable skin, the Red Riding Hood type skin. This is the Highlander glider. Storm Sigil. Touchdown is for obviously Tom Brady. Paper Priscilla was a Season 3 Victory Royale. This is a Season 7 Victory Royale. This is a Season 6 Victory Royale Umbrella. Season 4 Interceptor, which is a Carbite. That's the Sun Strider Glider. This is like a Western Wilds Glider. This is a Season 7 Durberger Glider. And this is the Crossfire, the Cruiser, the Downshift from like the RPM and the Cobra crew. This is my very first Victory Royale Umbrella. This is a Season 2 Victory Royale Umbrella. But I'm really sad I never bought Season 2 because it was like a classic. I could have got the Red Knights and everything. Uh, this is just your standard glider. Founders Umbrella because I'm a Founders member and a Founders Glider. Season 5 Victory Royale Umbrella and the Royal Air part of the Powder Patrol set. I forget how I bought that or how I earned that but it looked cool so I got it. Anyways, here's my contrails. We got the All-Star, the Bats, the Bubbles, the Cash Flow, Dark Feathers, Exhaust, Lightning, Lanterns, Jack-O-Lanterns, Icicles for the Ragnarok, Hearts, Glitch in the System, Flames, Fireflies, Rainbow, Retro Sci-Fi, Runic, Shooting Star, Spray Paint, Ultramarine, uh, this is like, I don't know what that is or how I got that. I think that's from Season 7, Lightning and Thunder set. We got the Snowflake one, which is really cool. That's really cool. We got the TP, which is just toilet paper. Apparently you can't see anything when flying down using that, so I never use it. We got the String Lights from Season 6, 7, Battle Pass. And we have the Spiritual Essence from the Clematity or Wild Western thing. And yeah, that's all my things there. These are weapon wraps I have unlocked. Yeah, you pretty much wrap your gun in Season 7 now. It's pretty cool, they're all the same. But yeah, my guns look like this in the game now. Except for my vehicles. And yeah, here's my OG remix 
Fortnite CD, there's the festive music, there's the epic, spooky music, and squeaky clean, and random. But I'm gonna put it back on festive. And yeah, there you guys have it, my favorite uh, skin. So yeah, if you guys wanna be entered in the giveaway, don't forget to subscribe, be an active viewer and subscriber on my channel. Like, comment, and comment down below your favorite skin or emote and why you want it and what you do with it. So yeah, it, as always, it's been another Waxy TV upload and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to become one of the Waxy Army fan base members. And also keep in touch with me on my social medias at Waxy TV. I have Instagram, Snapchat, Twitch and YouTube. I don't use Twitter that much, but you can at me at Twitter at Revo underscore Wax, and I'll be able to get your Twitter DMs too. So, anyways, guys, as always, see you later.